Queen taught lesson on loyalty to Harry and Meghan with important message chases traitors out. The Queen's announcement regarding Camilla's future title of Queen Consort was a message to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle to show loyalty matters, according to commentator. The Queen's announcement over Camilla being a future Queen Consort is believed to be a message about loyalty to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Harry and Meghan left royal working life to start a new life in the US and last year sent shockwaves with bombshell claims about the royal family during an interview with Oprah Winfrey. Rumored tensions over the Sussexes and the Frim have continued as the Queen looks to celebrate her Platinum Jubilee this year. American PR expert and commentator Eric Schiffer feels the announcement by the Queen on the eve of her Ascension Day, celebrating 70 years on the throne, was the reason for the Duke and Duchess silence. The move to announce the Duchess of Cornwall as a future Queen consort was to show loyalty matters, according to Mr. Schiffer. He believes the Queen does not view them as being loyal and feels what they have done is viewed as a decapitation of Her Majesty's trust. Mr. Schiffer told the Daily Star, I think the Queen's move, Camilla announcement, seems designed, in part, to public opinion by creating this further connection to the Crown and is clearly, secondarily directed at Meghan and Harry and their loyalty. It, loyalty, means something to her, Queen. The silence by Harry and Meghan suggests that the message may have been received. Mr. Schiffer added, I think it sends a message that loyalty counts, which I don't think the Queen views as being loyal. Quite the opposite, it is sort of a decapitation of loyalty. The Queen became the first British monarch in history to celebrate a platinum jubilee on Sunday. In a message to the nation, the Queen expressed her sincere wish that Camilla will be known as Queen Consort when the Prince of Wales becomes King. Her Majesty was congratulated by several royals and notable figures but the Duke and Duchess remained silent. Speaking to GB News host Dan Wooten, Royal expert Robert Jobson revealed his thoughts on the Sussex's online silence following the Queen's unprecedented announcement. In a message released on Saturday, Monarch stated, When, in the fullness of time, my son Charles becomes king, I know you will give him and his wife Camilla the same support that you have given me, and it is my sincere wish that, when that time comes, Camilla will be known as Queen Consort as she continues her own loyal service. Mr. Jobson, who co-authored the 2002 book Diana, Closely Guarded Secret, was asked by the Kiwi-born presenter whether the online silence from the Sussexes is telling as the royal couple think a lot about their communications and how they are going to be read into. Mr. Wooten went on to ask, do we get the idea that William has accepted this and Prince Harry hasn't? Mr. Jobson replied, I think that is what they are trying to say. Prince William is more pragmatic, there is no doubt about that because he is going to be the king, he has to be really. He has to be a bit more grown up about all this. But you must remember when Harry's mum died, he was only a little boy, he was only twelve. And he would have found it emotionally difficult to say the very least to accept Camilla as his stepmom. However, he continued to explain the relationship between the Duke of Sussex and his stepmother may be a bit more complicated. He said, you don't get the impression that Harry is particularly fond of Camilla. The royal expert also spoke about Harry's upcoming memoir, which is set to be released later this year and speculated about the part Camilla could play in the book. Mr. Jobson said last night while appearing on GB News, we will wait to see what he says in this book and I'm sure that it is not going to be good. I'm sure it is going to be negative about Camilla.